pollination. Flowers are the reproductive part of the plant. Flower helps to make seeds. When the seeds fall on the ground, they give rise to a new plant. Do you know how seeds are formed in flowers? The anther of the flower has fine yellowish powder called pollen. The pollen is transferred from the male part of the flower, that is the anther, to the female part of the flower, that is the stigma. This is called pollination. The pollen then moves down to the style, and reaches the ovary. Here the seeds are formed. There are two main types of pollination, self-pollination, and cross-pollination. Self-pollination In self-pollination, the pollen from the anther of a flower, is transferred to the stigma of the same flower, or the stigma of another flower on the same plant. Cross-pollination in cross-pollination, the pollen from the anther of a flower on one plant, is transferred to the stigma of the flower on another plant of the same species. Do you know, what helps the plants for pollination? Pollination takes place through abiotic agents like wind and water. The biotic agents like insects, birds and animals also help in pollination. The wind, water, insects, birds and animals are called pollinators. Do you know, how plants attract insects, and birds to help in pollination? The bright, colorful petals of the flower attract insects, and birds. The flower's fragrance also attracts insects. The birds, and insects come to the flowers to collect nectar. Question time. Drop the following in the correct circle. Every week, you will be notified by a new video. So, don't forget to subscribe, and click the notification bell. Thank you for watching Make It Easy Education.